slide into the Mac Park. I got a basketball, and guess what? I got real sweat on me, Bill. You know, that's something, uh, our makeup department isn't that good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been meaning to talk to them, and uh, where are they anyway? I mean, I could use a towel right now. Hey, you know, I, they're on their way, but it, it's, it's a tough job. Well, that's all right. You know what? At least you picked a spot. It's shady over here. You know, I'm cooling down a little bit, but I'm going to get back out there, because I like to put in about two hours there when I'm working out at Mac Park. Now, I saw uh, a trophy. Oh yeah. From 1979. How long you been doing it? <laughs> Bill, I started playing basketball when I was 12 years old, and we moved around here. And I started playing at Mac Park when I was 14 years old. So um, I'm I'm a couple years older now. And, you and, sure. Yeah. And, okay. and but you don't I, look that way out on the court now. Thank you, Bill. Thank you. You know why? Because this isn't the old me. This isn't the young me, it's just me, and this is what I do. Um, you, you know, at home, I come up here to this park because I've always loved being up at Mac Park. We've had some legends up here, Bill. Um, everybody from, I'm not going to name everybody because I don't want to leave anybody out, but everybody from Bill Barry, who was professional grade, to uh, Billy Gosa, Todd Turner, you name it, they were up here at this park. And they've all come through Mac Park. And they've all come through Mac Park. And uh, I want to spend, uh, send a special shout out too to Fred Randolph because Fred has been working with the uh, baseball team, uh, the Little League across the street there, Bill, ever since I can remember. And before that, his father was uh, working with him. So neighborhood tradition still prevails. Neighborhood tradition still prevails. Uh, we have some issues that I want to talk about a little bit about Mac Park. Um, mainly, uh, I, would, I would like to see more of you at home come out and enjoy this fantastic park because it is a part of our community and it does have a purpose because back in the day it was it was the thing that held us all together if you wanted to find your friends you'd find them up here playing basketball at Mac Park um, and I'm looking at the court bill and I noticed that I saw a few uh, cracks in the court uh, for the city of Wilmington I see you working on the streets and I, that's all well and good I appreciate that but at this time when our children need something definitely need some things to do we need to take a look at our parks don't you agree Bill? Yes sir because <coughs> If you do not do the maintenance now, 
Then in a year or two, oh, we don't have the money because it needs to be replaced. Yeah, yeah. So right now, update. There's grass growing in the middle of Mack Park Court. Not supposed to be there. And <clears throat> come winter, that's just going to make it a situation where next year there'll be more grass. More grass. And more grass to cut. So you're not saving any money anyway by you not taking care of the court. Right, exactly. You still got to cut the grass. Yeah, and then, and then what am I going to do? If I can't blow off this theme, it's a problem. I need this park, man. Well, it, not only you, but we got a whole generation of young people, you know, and we cry and moan that, oh, the young people today, but they have to have the facilities in order to have positive things to do. So true, so true. And, and you know what, Bill, I take, I take pride in the fact that <clears throat> coming up here, I do get a chance to interact with our young people in the community. And um, all of you guys out there, I just love playing basketball with you here at Mac Park and uh, I'm talking about I'll see generations Bill and, and I'm getting up there a little bit now so I start to see other generations. I'll see two generations, three generations of people up here playing basketball. I love it. It's, it's really good for the community and it's good for you. It's good for your body. It makes it does a body good, you know? There you go. <laughs> and it's a lot easier than eating spinach. Yeah, you know? <laughs> Won't find any Popeyes here, bro. No Popeyes. <laughs> Well, what can I say, Bill? Um, I just love Mac Park. Uh, it is a tradition, and the location for this park is at 5th and Cleveland Avenue in West Wilmington. That's 5th and Cre Cleveland Avenue, just a couple blocks up from Green Hill Avenue. Right yeah, there. real easy to find. Yeah, yeah. Just make a, if you're going down uh, Green Hill Avenue towards Lancaster, just make a right at 6th, and you'll run right into it. That's it. That's what I told this man, and guess what? He's here. I was even able to find Live and in living color. There you go. Should I show him the trophy, Bill? Uh, yes. Why don't you do that? Okay.